The overall goal of this microfluidic bioprinting methodology is to generate a vascularized tissue construct. This method can solve key questions in biofabrication of vascularized tissues. The main advantage of this technique is that it is versatile in generating a three-dimensional shape-controlled vascular bed for engineering vascularized tissues through a secondary cell seeding process. Though this protocol provides insight into engineering vascularized cardiac tissues, it can also be applied to many other tissue types such as liver, skin, and even cancers. Generally, individuals new to this method may struggle because setting up the bioprinter may not be simple. To start this procedure, construct a dual-layer concentric microfluidic printhead by inserting a smaller blunt needle serving as the core into the center of a larger blunt needle serving as the sheath. Make sure that the core needle is protruding from the outer shell approximately one millimeter. After that, insert a 23 gauge needle in the barrel of the central needle in the reverse direction. Make a hole on the side of the barrel of the outer needle and insert a matching size metal connector. Seal with epoxy glue. Mount the extruder onto the head of a bioprinter using a polymethyl methacrylate or PMMA holder. Next, for injection of the bio ink and the cross-linking solution through two PVC tubes individually, connect the inlets of the print head to a dual-channel syringe pump. <laughs> 